never should have come here. All right, so I guess Orangoth is probably sent for backup. Or these mercenaries might have realized the place was under attack. But anyway, I spoke to Orangoth in the previous video, so I should have access to his safe now. So once I've cleared out this safe, I can head back to the Thieves Guild and it'll be job well done. But yeah, it seems like the safe is down in the cellar area. Just that's where the marker's pointing. So that must be downstairs. Yeah, and I do remember this mansion being connected to a sewer system, but I can't remember if it goes all the way to Riften or if it's just on this island. I'm not sure if I need a key to go down there or... Well, it's just another way to exit the island. But yeah, I can't remember if I need a key or if I can just lockpick it open. I've got plenty of lockpicks anyway. Alright, I can see a couple of mercenaries at the other side of this room. Doesn't look like they've noticed me. Yeah, and I do apologise for the amount of blood and gore, by the way. Well, I've had the enhanced blood textures mod for quite a while. I had it for most of Season 1, I don't know if you remember. Yeah, but anyway, I'm in the cellar area. But it looks like I need to go even further down, so I guess we'll soon be underground. Yeah, I wonder how many mercenaries I've killed in total now. And how many more are left? That's if there is any left. But you know, it must have been very expensive to hire these. I mean, I'm pretty sure you can hire mercenaries at taverns, but they're about 500 gold, probably a bit more. So, you know, just for 10 of these, it would be 5 grand. At least. I'm pretty sure I've killed more than 10, though. I'd say between 20 and 30. Just there was about 10 outside, and I must have killed about 10 inside of here. And, you know, some more while I'm down in the cellars. Alright, so it looks like the key does not open this chest. But the key I got from Orangoff should unlock the safe. Alright, so I've burned all three of the beehives as requested and 
I've managed to keep Orangoff alive. Yeah, so I've done as the Thieves Guild have asked. So yeah, they should be alright. Yeah, this looks like the sewer network. Yeah, I'm just gonna go down this tunnel. Just I'm curious. I'm not surprised to see ski uh ski in here. Hopefully there's hidden treasure down here. That's one of the reasons why I'm going this way. Alright, this door is well locked for some strange reason. Don't know why they've got so much wine lying down here. Somebody, uh, somebody's probably been living down here. From the looks of it. Alright, so that's why it was well secure. Yeah, and it just gets the lock picking skill up. That's another reason why I try and unlock lots of locked doors and chests. So I guess that's the end of the tunnel. Yeah, I wonder where the exit is. I'm pretty sure it'll still be on the island though. Yeah, so now I can fast travel back to the Thieves Guild. Yeah, so I'm glad I've unlocked like a quick entrance so I don't have to go all the way down the rat way. Well, not anymore. So yeah, I can just use that secret button and then it should open up the floor so I can go underground into the Thieves Guild area. <laughs> 